all bras are not created equal, and it took an actress to realize bigger isn't always a better fit. I'm a 32 G, double G, H, depending, and I could not find a bra that would fit me. She and her husband started a business for women who are overdeveloped and underserved. I remember going to the bra lady, and the bra lady was an institution in every community. Jeanette Goldstein is a lifelong character actress whose most famous role was the buxom Marine Vasquez in the movie Aliens. Large busted, but with a smaller rib cage, bras were always a challenge. Then in her 40s, I went to my son's graduation and I saw a picture of myself and I thought I was dressed really well. And I looked, I remember thinking, I look matronly and, um, and like a stripper at the same time. Goldstein had had enough. She discovered the bras she needed were in London. And so, like Vasquez, she got angry. These bras exist, and why aren't they being sold in the United States? And to my husband, like, you know, why doesn't someone open a store like this? Why doesn't someone do this? And he said, why don't we do it? So in 2009, she and her husband, artist Aaron Noble, launched Jeanette Bras, where, quote, the alphabet starts at D. No one would lend us money. We had a line of credit, though, that we had gotten during the times that they were giving lines of credit to anyone at those. <laughs> With $10,000, she bought her first set of large cup, well-constructed, pretty bras from Europe. Because the straps hold 10% of the weight. If, if you're That's no, all? It's the band that provides the support. Goldstein made mistakes along the way. Online sales were a flop. This is a business that requires the personal touch. She fired herself as bookkeeper after overpaying the IRS. But as an artist, she knew how to create an experience. And she soon learned the most popular bras were also the most expensive. Because you put it on and you just say, this is, this is worth it. Sales this year will hit $1.7 million across three stores. Jeanette Goldstein finally has a bra that fits, but her financial cup runneth over. Now when I go into the supermarket or I go to a museum, women are constantly looking at me and then flashing me their underwear. Hey CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the I right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.